how to not make a good portfolio website, 10 tips. 10. Don't design with mobile in mind. 92.3% of all web traffic is mobile. Don't let those people see this. Make it not fit on the screen. The larger your site is, the better. Scale the entire thing down. Size matters. Make sure it's only readable by mice or other small animals. The smaller the animal is that can read it, the better. 9. Don't show any of your work on your site itself. Make every project an external link. Show them you can't be bothered to show them. Interrupt the user journey. Drive visitors away from your website. Who knows, maybe they'd want to purchase this amazing hydrophobic duck costume from that Bob's hunting gear and disguise website you built for a client. 8. Add horizontal scrolling. There is nothing better than making a CEO of a respectable financial organization proudly demonstrate the dominant Slavic housewife's near me page to his colleagues when he accidentally goes back in the browser history. He's always been secretly wanting to do that. Don't let him down. 7. Add background music. Preferably a song your grandfather likes. If you have multiple grandfathers, pick the one that served the sentence in prison. The louder the song is, the better. Let the visitor briefly shit themselves because of not knowing where the sound is coming from. And then, after they figure it out, let them embrace the beautiful synergy of your grandfather's prison folklore with Taylor Swift playing on their Spotify. 6. Add many animations. The slower, the better. The more, the better. Don't let the visitors see anything right away. Make them wait. Good things come to those who wait. Sometimes they don't come. Add a progress bar on every page also. 5. Forget your... <coughs> Sorry, that's uh, that's a different presentation. 5. Forget UX. The more beautiful your site is and the harder it is to use, the better. Aim for beauty, but not for the beauty of functionality. Think Sarah Jessica Parker, not Sarah Connor. 4. Don't look at everyone else's portfolios. The less you know about your competition, the better. Otherwise, you're running a risk of creating something original. 3. Don't make it until you're ready. You're not ready yet. Spend 40 years preparing. You're not ready for preparing yet. Prepare to prepare first. Spend 40 years preparing to prepare. Don't make it until you have enough skill. Spend 40 years learning C or binary or actually math. Actually, start with learning how to learn. What you know already is already enough to build an insane web experience. Don't let this fact fool you into building a good portfolio website. 2. Don't make it. Nothing is always better than anything. 1. Add a circle that follows a cursor. 